To every each and every one of you out there watching a very warm welcome my name is Donato aka the reluctant guru and welcome to my weekly running update thank you so much to everybody who watched last week and has commented and given me some feedback and we're coming on to that you may have heard me mention about uh, people who talk say they hate running and as I said last week and uh, I think it might be a topic we'll go into more detail but really if you hate something why do you do it? Why? 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 What's the point? Mamma mia, what's the point? Eh? If you hate running, stop. Find something else that you enjoy. If you hate running, you can feel really good just sitting in a sauna for 20 minutes. But we'll talk more about it next week. Maybe you want to comment, like down there. And I really do appreciate everybody's comments, whether it be on public comments on here, or if you send me private messages, emails on the social meds. Get in touch, let me know what you think. If you hate things, don't, don't, don't do it. This is a question that came in, you may have seen in last week's comment. Um, there's a guy called uh, F Documents, the Folkestone Documents. He's documented all sorts of things. And uh, he was asking about my training plan. What do I do in terms of running? Um, how do I run? Running consecutive days, is that good? You know, do I have rest days? How to avoid injury? Now, I've got to stress, what I'm going to talk about is what I do, yeah? Which can, works for me, may not work for all of you. At the end of the day, we're all different, aren't we? Yeah? In terms of how I run, it's all about the recovery. So I very rarely do consecutive days running, very rarely. My weekly runs, I might run and, <laughs> yes, I may run quick, but I don't run every day, never. I've never run every day and I probably never will run in every day. For me, I'm still, I regard myself as a beginner. I've been going what, 22 months, 23 months now. So I still regard myself as a beginner training runner. So when I first started as a beginner, I was running three times a week. On Tuesday, I would be running Thursday, and then at weekend, I'd have my long run either on a Saturday or Sunday, depending on what the family schedule was, and what I was doing that week. That's me, three runs as a beginner. That's perfectly fine. The key thing with whatever training you do, it's important to be consistent and regular. Run what works for you at the times that work for you. And uh, for me as a beginner, three times a week is fine. Now I'm up to four. Four days a week I run. And for me, it's all about the recovery. The people talk about active recovery and there are guys out there and I think I talked about Harry Runs on one of the YouTubes. He's got a great running channel. He's at the top, he's, he's, he runs every day. He does stress in his videos, he's been running 16 years. 16 years, when Paula Radcliffe attained her world record, she'd been running for around 15, 16 years. So for people like me, who've only been going 20 odd months, 22 months, am I gonna be able to run at those speeds every day? These people do like 100 miles a week, 120 miles a week. Yeah, I get nowhere near that. I think I might top out at maybe 50K on my long runs coming up to marathon training. So for me, in terms of recovery, yes, people talk about active recovery, but for me, I really do recover. My opinion, the most important part of a training plan is rest. And more importantly, sleep, getting lots of sleep. Make sure you have at least seven, eight hours sleep a day. It's rock and roll lifestyle of a uh, endurance runner, isn't it? Eh? There's nothing macho about only getting one or two hours sleep a night or whatever. It's, it's, it's all important for that. I mean, you see so many videos of how to run a marathon in this time, whatever, how to do that. It's what about what do you need to do to get to it? So for me, it's all about the training, keeping it key, but enjoying it, you know, keeping off, <laughs> keeping off this stuff. Yeah, yeah. So enjoy that. Eat lots of this fruit, it's really good for you, yeah? Um, yeah. 
tangerines, apples. Yeah, enjoy that. Recovery is really important. Eating good food. For me, it's mainly pizza and pasta uh, for breakfast. No, no, not for breakfast. Um, yeah, breakfast is cereal, oats. Oats tends to work for me. Bananas, that type of stuff. And then lunch and dinner or tea, whatever you want to call it, or dinner and tea, um, is predominantly carbohydrates for me, which is pizza and pasta. Now and again, Indian food, really nice, but again with rice, naan breads, uh, nice meat. And Chinese food, again, still has rice and uh, meat and proteins for me. So that's what works for me, and it's um, really good. I hope that's answered your question. Mr. Folkestone documents and I really appreciate your question and if there's any other questions that people want me to cover topics on then please do get in touch. Maybe you can comment, I mean some of the comments about my dancing, did you see my dance last week? Ooh. I, I don't feel like jumping out of my seat this time like doing a dance but mm -hmm. Oh, honey, honey, you are my candy girl, and you got me wanting you. Back to the talking. Did you enjoy that? I've started using something, something really hit me in technology world and all that types of world. There's, there's something that comes in and I look at it and I think, wow, wow. What a game changer that is. And last week I started using an app called Relive. As it implies, is Relive what you've done. Now, with my running and stuff, it's, it's an application that shows in a nice 3D way. And I think I'll put a link down in my uh, comments here to the uh, application. And maybe a link to one of my runs. But effectively, you might have seen on some of these... Um, big races like London or whatever and you get a little dot that follows a map and the route in 3D and all that. Well this application Relive does all of that. It's it's amazing. I absolutely love it. I even blogged about it. I mean oh it's rare for me to do a blog but uh, absolutely love it. It's gonna go viral. It's already going viral. I think they're in the tens of thousands of people using it maybe up to hundreds of thousands. It'll soon pass the millions and it will go into the tens of millions. Millions of people will be using this. I believe, anyway, that's my gut feel. It's fantastic, it's simple. All I did was connect it with me uh, Garmin, used for me runs, I think you can connect it with your Strava if you use that as well, and maybe other devices as well. But um, but yeah, click on the link, download it. I'm not getting paid for any of this. They, I, I don't know who the hell these guys are who've done it, or girls, what they've done. Um, but it's amazing and, and I love it. When, the first time I saw someone uh, using it on the social meds, I thought I've got to get this and I've got it and other people now have started using it that's seen what I've been posting. So get out there and use it and relive your experience of the run of the stuff. So that concludes my little brief talks of what's been happening uh, this week. Thank you so much for watching. As I say, if you do like these, give it a thumbs up. And the subscribes down there. Love, guru, love. Next week, I may be talking more about these headphone things. What, what, what? Do you wear headphones? What? Like, oh. Do you wear headphones when you run out on the streets in the public? Yeah, do you wear these? Do you wear these or not when you go out training? Do you wear them when you do races? Maybe we'll talk about this next week and the whys and wherefores, and what I do, and how it does and doesn't work for me. So everyone's different, we'll talk more about headphones, but leave some comments down here of maybe what you might want to talk about, and maybe we'll even touch on the uh, the I Hate Running Club again, and uh, see if they uh, conform to actually enjoying running, or finding something that they do enjoy, involve something that they hate. So to all of you out there, I love I love you. I love each and every one of you. And I think it's amazing what you're all doing and joining in with this great activities. Something that I really love and enjoy is the running. And it's such great fun. And uh, I hope to continue it and share the love, spread the love. So to all of you, 
Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for liking, subscribing. I love it. Keep the comments coming. And we'll see you next week. But remember, whatever you do, wherever you go, wherever you are, enjoy it. But fundamentally, always keep running. Yeah! <laughs>